Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this session, we will learn about the partial filter expression. In the previous session, we have seen how we are unable to apply the unique index to the non existing document fields, right? We have seen that when we don't have an email field doesn't exist for one or more documents, it is not allowing us. Why? Because the non existence of the document field is also considering it as an unique thing. So it should not happen it like that and also we can also use this partial filter expression in many different ways let's say that we have a scenario in such a way that let's say this is our dob value okay or otherwise let's say dob value okay dob dot value now this the this value i don't want to apply index to complete collect complete documents in this collection okay i don't want to apply this one for example let's say that i want to create index i will create an index in such a way that i want to apply dob sorry dob dot value it should be an ascending order ascending order like this i'll apply now this one will create an index to all the dob value documents for example let's say that you are having one lakh survey data records we have seen it right so for all the one lakh survey data records it will apply the index in a ascending order it will create a reference pointer in the memory location for these all the things so this creates somewhat memory usage more and all those things now let's say that i don't want to apply this index thing to all the documents present in the collection i want to apply only the index to only a particular set of documents on it let's say that greater than 70 or greater than 80 the values which are greater than 80 i want to have a I want to create an index who are having greater than, less than 70 i don't want to apply those indexes so i don't want those all things so if you want it like this means so you can use this all uh, you can use this partial filter expression what is the benefit of this one is you will not create index for all the documents you will create an index for only some of the documents which comes under this filter criteria and also this uh, i already told you right when we are trying to insert the in the index documents so the insertion will be very slow why because we need to add that index uh, that create inserted document also in the index thing whereas in this partial filter expression so if you are have if you are inserting the document which comes under this filter expression only it will create an index remaining all it will not create an index so that is the benefit of this one so let's try to see for example let's say in this one here we are having db dot survey data dot find dot count so we are having one lakh records let's say what are the survey data dot get indexes so get index what are the indexes available let's try to see so we are having only one index that is the index for id which is a unique thing okay leave it now we need to create an index db dot survey data dot create index of I want to create an index for dob dot value dob dot value which is of type one so which is index uh, ascending order and here in this one we will be having partial filter expression so we need to add a condition for this one so for what are the type of values i want to add so here you can say that uh, you can also use the another field also something age which is having dollar greater than 50 you can use this scenario also so you can use so that means who are having the age greater than 50 please add that one in the uh, index with the dob value okay like this also we can use or otherwise we can also use the dob value thing also so let's say try to apply this dob value for example let's say we will add a we'll add this with age only so that means we need to add an index for dob dot value whose age is greater than 50 okay now let's try to press enter so this index will be created so here you can use exist greater than less than whatever the thing you want you can use it in the partial filter expression now let's say that i am using db dot survey data dot find dot explain let's try to take the explain dot find so whatever the thing i want i want to find dob dot value so which is dollar greater than 70 or something like this i'll try to apply okay if you try to apply so what is the thing okay so here i need to use the like this and we need to remove this one so if i try to explain explain 
is also wrong Let's try to take explain if i try to use this one here what is the concept it has used it has used the full collection scan what is the reason is here it has to use the combination dob value with a combination of age then only we can get this index scan now if i want to check something like dob value greater than 70 and also age greater than 50 okay if you try to use this one so let's try to see about the explain thing now if you do try to see the explain uh, explain now it is using the index scan so it is using the index why because we are having the combination dob value with a with the, with the age so if you want you can also use the dob value with a combination of partial ex expression also so now the combination with the dob value with the age greater than 50 it is trying to check for example we have created a partial expression of the age which is greater than 50 right let's try to see i will check the which age greater than 30 if you try to see this one here what it will try to do again it, it went to the collection scan why because the indexes are created only for the DO for the ages which are greater than 50 only so now you are checking the age greater than 30 means there may be the fields there may be the documents available which doesn't come under the index because of that reason it will try to use the collection scan so now in which type of scenarios you will try to do is so when you know that this type of query we are using so we can use this uh, so particular type of query we are using we don't want all the documents to be added in the index if you want it means you can use this partial filter expression so this is the usage of this partial filter expression now let's try to go back to our unique index thing so we have seen our db dot users dot find this one right so here we are having email if i want to add another email something like insert one and here i will try to add name of something like leela uh, so this is not a unique thing so we can add whatever you want so here it is saying email cannot be added email duplicate thing so here what we need to do is so let's try to get the indexes what we are having the indexes get indexes okay so here we are having an index right so let's try to remove that index db dot users dot drop index of oh sorry which one we have applied email of one okay i removed this index now let's try to apply index so db dot users dot create index create index uh, i want to apply for the email it should be a one and i want to apply unique true for this one and we can use a partial filter expression partial filter expression so which one i want to apply so partial filter expression for the email which oh for the email which exists okay which exists true that is the thing so now what i am trying to do i am trying to create an index for an email which is of type unique and only apply to the apply index to the emails which are which, which document is having email if the document doesn't have an email field don't apply the index to it one so now if i press enter it has been created now let's try to see the find thing okay here we are having an email which doesn't have an email now let's try to insert the thing so let's try to see insert one lila two if i try to insert now it is successfully inserted so for example if i try to insert db dot users dot insert one and here you can have a name of type leela4 or something like this and the email i want to insert the same email which is already existing in that one if i try to insert here it will tell the duplicate email okay why because email is existing now it will try to check the uniqueness but if you don't have an email if you don't provide an email here if you remove this email if you don't provide an email it will be inserted automatically so this is the usage of this partial filter expression not only for the uniqueness you can also check that if you want to apply the if you want to apply the index for only a particular set of documents matching that filter condition means you can use this partial filter expression hope you understood about this partial filter expression if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you